Facing Waves is brought to you by the Croatian National Tourist Board. Visit us online at croatia.hr. The Upper Cetina River is one of Croatia's deepest river canyons, and with Class 5 whitewater and a spectacular but unrunnable waterfall, few paddlers have ever considered launching their kayaks into the canyon. Just a short ways downstream, the whitewater picks up again with an impressive and runnable drop, but with nearly impossible access. Undeterred by the challenge of both getting into position and running the rapid, the NRS team gets some help from the Croatian Mountain Rescue Team with hopes of putting their skills to the ultimate test. It's something that we've been looking at for quite a while and um, what it was is you, you had to paddle this long um, like 200 meter plus vertical walled canyon um, and uh, all of a sudden it, it gets this big waterfall maybe 45-50 meters so you literally take out right at the, the top of the waterfall and you get off and you can look down from the top of the first waterfall with this epic backdrop with all the cliffs coming in. But then there's a tunnel on your left which you walk in and it's super narrow, dark and you kind of have to hobble through this tunnel until you get to an opening in the cliff. The guys that were with us were, were two things, they were Mountain Rescue and from a local canyoning company so they're really experienced in that canyon, they know exactly what they're doing, they're all over the rope stuff and uh, they talked us through it and they, they were, you know, amazing. Under rest we have a big waterfall. Uh, we need to rappel down, so it's around 55 meters above us. And we will be lowering you and your kayaks down. A friend of mine is waiting for you down to help you because you will just land on the edge of the waterfall which you are running today. It was a, a terrifying scene almost, just because the rock hole just led out into the drop, so there was a pretty steep lip and looking down you could see that there was nowhere really for you to land. There is just a gap in the rock, so you do hook on and you abseil out and you're just in this abyss of a huge canyon. It was pretty big hate for me. First of all it was scary, but once you, like, once you committed and you did that step back and you were like hanging in the wall, then you look up and you see like the canyon walls and it's like so big and so massive and you feel so small that moment. Once we got into the pool, they threw us a line and, and uh, swung us out over the next waterfall which we were going to run. So that was the only opportunity to scout really was just looking down like this as you're swinging over the waterfall. There was a dude set up over on the other side that threw you a line and you clipped on and he kind of pulled you over the top right on the lip of the waterfall so you were kind of, your feet were dangling right off as you were crossing the river to get in on the other side. Really all those guys, world class paddlers, uh, I knew that it's really not a problem for them if just I can help them to get down. If I bring them to the water, the rest is a piece of cake for them. talking the whole time about this this burger joint being right at the takeout. We probably got off the river at about six or seven in the evening and um, all super hungry, we had a really long day. Um, and sure enough, there it was, this, this burger joint right next to this waterfall at the takeout of the river. I think the best reason to come to Croatia is a little bit different from other areas of Europe. You've got mountains that just come straight out from the rivers and straight out from the ocean. And you've got these national parks that just have it incredible beauty everywhere. It's just a really good place to see something different, I think. I 